The time has come. <laughs> Allow me to extend my invitation. To save a people beyond salvation, there is only Ragnarok. <laughs> Cocoon suffers. Release her from the pain. What? So, this is the end of the rainbow, huh? Well, here's hoping the pot's full of tips on dealing with crackpot foul sea. Hmm. You know, I don't remember this being here before. I guess it's new, huh? Yeah, must be. I suppose it might be a record of what happened. You know, after we turned to crystal. Where the slaves of Lindsay dwell is the enemy of all life fostered by Pulsar's sacred hand. So Alpha C determined Pulsar's will, chose Lissy, and gave them a focus. Become Ragnarok and bring about the end of Cocoon. And so the beast arose, defeated Lindsay's hateful Falsi, and prepared to tear Cocoon apart. But her providence betrayed Alasi, draining Ragnarok of strength. Their focus only half complete, the Lassi were taken to the enemy's land by Bartandalus, curse his name. And the goddess said, Lassi who rest upon Cocoon will reawaken, however long they may wait. And Ragnarok will rise again to tear the land from its seat in the sky. Her word is absolute. Guess the jig is up. Ugh. Cocoon's done for, isn't it? Yeah, you don't sweat it. If we go ahead and smash Cocoon, you know some makers sure to roll up and save the day. <laughs> as long as Fal C are around, this fight is never gonna end. So let's finish it. Let's get Dysley. So what do we do about Orphan? We help Orphan. What else can we do? If we can manage to keep it safe, another war breaks out somewhere down the road. We're Lassie. It's not like we can make people stop fighting. <sighs> Lightning. You told me on Cocoon. It's not a question of can or can't. We just do it. That's our only choice this time. Maybe it won't do much. Maybe only one person will listen to us. 
But even then, isn't trying better than doing nothing? <laughs> because ripples can make waves. <laughs> okay, kids have gone crazy. Revolutionaries always get cold crazy. <laughs> when I was on Cocoon, I wished on those fireworks. I wished to not let anything happen to Cocoon this time. But I shouldn't have wished for that. Uh. <laughs> Wishes aren't enough. Prayers either. This time I'm making a promise. I will keep Cocoon safe. I promise. No matter what. I guess it takes losing everything to make you see how much you have to fight for. Huh. And we're the only ones who can do it. Right? Right. <laughs> yep. All right, then. Let's tie up loose ends. Okay. Right. All right. Yeah. <laughs>